Okay, guys, last part of this nail video series is my organization. I went to Home Goods and I purchased this little table because I need a place to store all my nail stuff away. So I purchased this really cute glass with chrome finish table. It has three shelves and I thought it was pretty cool. Along with that, I purchased these like makeup kits. I have some of these in my bathroom and I thought that these were going to be also perfect to store my nail stuff. So along with this little table here, let me show you what I have. So here on top, I have little trays. I have a cup for brushes, acetone, alcohol, other little canisters. This is a silicone mat, and this is what you're supposed to use. I did order another one on Amazon. I'll show you the link down below. And this is to help protect your desk because you're going to have a lot of powder, a lot of dust, a lot of junk. And uh, that's why I'm, I want to get another one because I really like this one on this particular table. So here, these are poly gel nails. This is what they call the happy gel or hybrid gel for the one, two, three go nails from E-Nail Couture. I have here, I have my Hello Kitty cream and lotion. I also have this press on nail polish this is like a glue look how beautiful this bottle is so this is like a glue instead of using like a poly gel to adhere your press on nails because i'm not doing tips i'm just doing press on nails at this point either press on nails or just like a dip powder on just your regular nail i have my cuticle oil here as well my Sally Hansen cuticle oil. I've purchased this oil for like, since I was in high school. And then I have like a nail brush that came with one of the Medellin's poly gel nail kit. I love it. Okay. And then in this little tray, I have my dehydrators, primers, my top and bottom coats here. And on this tray, I got this little tray free from the Sephora Beauty Insiders. Uh, with points I have like little dipping pots and this one I'm gonna put like you can use monomer if you're gonna use acrylic or you can do like acetone and or alcohol to help you uh, like build your uh, poly gel when you're putting on your nails and they're just really cute two little glass ones I'll put down the link below I got it on Amazon so I have that here I have my Hello Kitty fragrant jewels cup this had an awesome Hello Kitty candle. You burn it off and then you get like a ring. So did not want to throw this away. And this is perfect for my brushes and whatnot. My new brushes, also my different brushes here. I have my cuticle uh, fork. I have other brushes. I have other like a cuticle pusher. So I have everything here that can be like on a cup. That's where I have it. And then I do have my acetone. I have my alcohol. I filled up this little bottle with just rubbing alcohol, 7% alcohol. And then I have more Beauty Insider uh, things I got. Jeez, this is like maybe five years ago, but this goes with this little tray here. But in this little guy, I have some cotton balls or little round pads. And on this one, I have like my lint free that came with the kit I showed you on a previous video and then I have some these are facial wipes from the cream shop but I'm gonna use them for hands because they're gonna be perfect for when I'm doing my nails I don't have a bathroom in here but to not be moving around and getting up all the time I can definitely use this it'll just help me have like everything in one here so that's my first shelf here then I have my second shelf and in here I have more acrylic makeup organizers I got at Home Goods. And this first little shelf I have my dipping powder system here. I have everything I need for my dipping powder. And this bottom shelf, it's a deeper shelf and I love that I can just remove it. I can take this out and just put it on my desk. So here I have my electric 
hand drill. Here I have my different ceramic nail bits. I have other drill bits. I have my little diamonds. Stripping tape, still don't know what to use. And I found these so long ago. These are for your nails. These are little Hello Kitty bows and little Hello Kitties too. Um, these are too bold to be honest with you. Totally love a Hello Kitty, had to get them, but you can do so much things for your nails that I'm just discovering, but uh, slow and steady for me. I'm not ready to be that bold yet. And then this is some other Hello Kitty, like press on nail color tapes that you can use. So I decided to put them all here. On the second drawer, I have uh, everything for a poly gel kit. So I have my dipping colors here and then the poly gel here and the different tubes. I don't know what to see. Little drawer, the last drawer, I have all of my hand files. I'm put them all here. And moving down to the bottom, there's some space here in between. So I have my UV lamp, I have my nail tray, and then I have this came with a mat. This is called an armrest, and this came with this mat here. And this is because uh, when you're going to do your nails, you know, you can rest your hand here and you can do your nails. So I decided to get a, a second set, like I said, because I also put a lot of pressure on my elbows. I noticed when I was doing these nails, I was wondering why my elbows hurt so much. So I got a second set to get another armrest, but to put it on my elbows to help with that. So there you go, a little armrest for when you do your nails. Now, along with this table here, not everything is for nails. Pretty much the top portion and middle is for nails and the rest is a little mixture of stationary and also nail stuff. So here at the bottom, I have some Hello Kitty Kleenexes. I have some forms, nail forms if I need them. And I have some, this is for when you're doing like a pedicure. And then these are just washi tapes that I thought, where am I gonna put them? But this drawer is so big. So I decided to do some ink stamps, little stationery kit there. And I thought these will go perfect there. They'll fit very well. This is the rest of my cotton little rounds I have here. I also have these forms for when I'm gonna remove my polish, my gel tips. I can use these, so I kept them here. And then the rest of the lint-free little paper towels here, are in here as well. So that's where I'm keeping this. Okay. At the top, because again, this is another makeup organizer. I got a small one and then I got a larger one to fit at the bottom. These are just, just to show you stationary stuff. Little notes. I have letter sets, I have some cards, envelopes, I have stickers here, all the small loose little stickers I need to put in this drawer. Here I have my wax seal kit and I was able to fit all in one. I had it in a kawaii box. I took it out and I'm surprised everything fit. Little different color waxes fit in here. My candles, I even have a little lighter for my candle. And then of course my seals. I have everything, everything fits in here. I have some envelopes, more stationary stuff, and that is it. This is my little nail table here, my little uh, nail bar, if you will. And I absolutely love it. Now, I could have put this on my desk that I have here in my room next to my window, but because I'm dealing with all these things that you're, I wanna make sure that they don't dry off like these guys here. So I needed to keep them away from the window because it gets very hot. So that's why I ended up buying this little table, putting it away from the light, away from the heat. And I think it fits perfectly here. 
So that is my video, guys, and that is what it looks like in between this bookshelf here and my corner shelf here. That is it, my little nail bar. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.